So tonight we have uh, have a, a nice prize pool, although I must admit it does look as though Jack's gonna miss his train home. Well, let's just play some Smash and forget about that. Yeah. <laughs> we'll cross that bridge when we come in. Now you see, Pidgey's going for Greninja. He went that game three. He did that game three last time. Um, I don't know, I mean, he certainly... I know that uh, Pidgey feels um, that the Toon Link Yoshi matchup is either even or slightly in Toon Link's favour. Yeah. Um, Hence the 70 30 tag. Yes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I saw that. So, but that 70 30 tag is a uh, uh, quote from Zan, oh, uh, right. who is a Toon Link player, um, quite a, a big Toon Link player. Oh. Um, and uh, he says that it's 70 30 in Yoshi's favour. Really? Yeah, against Toon Link. Huh. You should come to Scotland sometime. Yeah, you should, you should and see what happens. Yeah, you'd be the one what? Uh, I am going to be going after finals like, on the money, so because I've got a flight tomorrow at four or six. <laughs> Wait, hey Mickey, are you on a comp tailor? No, 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 no. no. All right. All right. Okay. I would in any other situation, I'd be all over, but I I need to be up at five a.m. So. <laughs> Okey-dokes. Man, you are not looking forward to a model. <laughs> no, I am not. It's going to be a very early start, but we get on with it, so it's all good. Yeah. Uh, it's here. No stuff's been taken just yet, but the way things are looking, yeah, up there, yeah, right there. Start. I mean, I'm going to be honest, I, I really, really don't mind the, uh, the Greninja matchup. Oh, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, I find it. I suppose though, if he feel if he feels like he's more confident as Greninja against Tim White, then all, all for it. In fairness, I've I've never actually uh, I've never actually played like a really good Greninja. Um, They're rare, very yeah, rare. Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, was are pretty rare. It took me a long time to get it, you know. Yeah, we're enjoying Kyle trying to invade the stream here, but yep. this is Kyle, why got, so we just have him go away. That's why fine. we DQ'd him. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I. I personally wouldn't agree with this matchup for uh, for Brian. I, I think we should just stick to Yoshi. Um, I mean, he has he has beaten Jack in the past, as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, it's doable. I mean, it is just like Pidgey. Don't get me wrong, is very very good. But um, I honestly just feel that that Jack is just that bit better. And I mean, to not oh, play yeah. to not play his main in this matchup, I think is a bad choice. But hey, I'm not I'm not him. He obviously knows what he's doing. Exactly. So not going to play. Um, but yeah, so far, I mean. Jack's as good as two stocks up here, so... Uh, I know. One, one of the bread and butter things to do with Greninja is up throw into the up air. You up, have to utilize fast falling up air. Yeah. Up air. Um, and if you can get good, if you can get good reads off, off stage, I mean, using that... Uh, using that um, down air off stage is oh, yeah, a great, great, that, yeah. great tool. Um, Very risky, though. I mean, I, I believe we saw that uh, when I studying was playing... Uh, Isam, uh, yeah. Beast, so... Since then, there's been a lot of Greninja's now crawling out the woodwork. <laughs> I mean, they're going to have to go some be as good as I study, and I, I genuinely think he's one of the best Greninja's in the world. Definitely. Um, if not the best, although saying that, I don't know any other Greninja's. So <laughs> yeah, I mean, forgive, are, forgive me out there, any Greninja players, but uh, yeah. yes, Jack Jack does have a train in about seven minutes. <laughs> so he's got to win this, then somehow make that ten minute walk to the train station. Yes, he does. That's doable. Now, the nair, that the was that was a good straight there. But, um, oh yeah, yeah. Because the nair for Greninja, it's a double-edged sword. Like I mean, when you hit it, you can fall off with so many things, or just leave it as it is. Yep. You miss that, like it, it leaves you open to so like again, leaves you open yeah. so hard. I mean, I, I I genuinely don't know a whole lot about Greninja, but yeah, I this, used to play him a bit. This matchup, I feel like is what. Oh wow. Oh. 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 Did I get a second? That's unfortunate. That. Was unfortunate, but I again, I didn't, I, I don't agree with his choice there. But yeah. I'd be interested to see if he swaps back to to Yoshi here. I personally be for it. No, but he's no, he's sticking it. Sticking, he's, he's sticking with Greninja. He feels that it's obviously the the better option. Here. I mean, it's respectable. Yeah. And we see maybe we're going to flat now. It's a tune way. Flats, Toon Link, Greninja. I mean, I, I would have thought Greninja would have wanted platforms to play with, but... 
Yeah, I mean, it does alright on Battlefield, actually. Yeah. I mean, I, I feel like platforms always help, like in oh, the majority yeah. of situations. Toon Link, on the other hand, is one of these characters that just doesn't really matter. Give him a flat zone, I mean, though. His, I mean, Toon Link's walling ability and his zoning ability are the best on FD, so... Exactly. Um, I mean... I mean, you can see it, like, you know, the, the walls Jack will create in order to prevent, like, and the re-grabs from bombs and things, it just gets everything out of the way, it stops bombs exploding on the platforms, you yeah. know, um, and stops other weird little things that can happen, like bombs bouncing back off shields and sitting nicely on the platforms. Yeah, the they just wait there. Yeah. Have you figured out how to do the bomb drop? Like, you can do that, yeah. Yeah, yeah the yeah. bomb drop, you just, uh, it's its just a case of dropping the bomb when you're a couple of frames off the ground. Oh, um, okay, yeah. is it precise? It is yeah. a very, very tight one. Because uh, I remember I was like, you know, play, like, I was just playing friendly, so I thought, oh, I'll pick up too much, try just see how it works. And I was like, I cannot do the bomb drop. I was sitting there, like, pressing it, just like, how does it work? It's, it's, it's what, I, I suppose it would be classed as an advanced technique, but... Yeah. Um, I mean, it's, it's a thing you've got to practice. I mean, it's, sure. it's usefulness, like, unless you're very good as Toon Link, isn't huge, but if yeah. you watch the way Jack does it, and um, those bomb ways, like, he'll use it to follow up with a, another bomb, mm -hmm. and I don't know exactly what he's doing. I think he's either maybe re grabbing them with an air dodge, yeah. very close to the ground. Um, but, either way, uh, that's, like, well-timed, like... It's, it's a well-timed technique. I mean, if you mess it up, you can end up hitting yourself, but... Uh, yeah. One of my favourite techs is uh, if you actually, it's, it's completely pointless, you literally just drop the bomb and re-grab it as you approach the ground. <laughs> is it just more about getting the quick finger? Yeah, yeah it's, it just looks fancy. Yeah, uh, I, I, I like it, but uh, I, didn't, I, like, I won't use it in tournament, but if I'm in friendlies, I'll... I'll well, I, th I think I saw you doing that this morning, actually. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, another another good one, I mean, Toon Link's all about fake-outs a lot as well, or, or my Toon Link is anyway. Yeah. Um, I mean, a lot of bomb, bomb throw catches, things like that. Um, but uh, Jack just running in trying to chip up damage here um, and then getting out of there like exactly which team should be playing. I mean, yeah. One thing I've noticed when playing is Doomlink is like um, when he's like going for that whole barrage of projectiles, you've kind of just got to rush in because like the time it takes for him to get his boomerang out, you could probably with the, boom, the, the boomerang. What the boomerang play, has run in and, stupidly slow startup. Yeah. So you can um, abuse that. You you can abuse that. Same with the bombs. If he's pulling out bombs in the air, just running and doing up aerial, like yeah. so, or, any, or or just an aerial, going to catch him. Because, I mean, you fair enough. Yeah, you might get hit with bomb, like big like, the bomb exploding. Yeah. But the damage you're going to get is going to be worth it every time. Yeah, it's it's worth the trade. Yeah, I mean, Jack looks fairly in control here. This is, like I say, I, I honestly think that this is an absolutely <laughs> too much favor. <laughs> Trying to bait him out there with that. And back air isn't nowhere near as strong as forward. For well, you see, apparently. Um, I, yeah, like, I mean, definitely, but apparently the, the bear can kill earlier than the fruit. Really? Yeah. Because it's generally used in the air, if you get in the air and it has upward, you know, upward yeah. knockback, you, I mean, it, it can just just do that. Mm. But, yeah, I mean, Pidgey's not down and out yet, Ooh. but, I mean... If he had side me there, I'd generally cry for him. Ninja with Rage is surprisingly one of the few characters where it's like not that. I want. I don't want to say not that big of a deal, but like it's not as much of as a threat as like for example Ike with Rage. Exactly. <laughs> um, but yeah, Pidgey trying to bring this back, but it's going to be again just like the last match when, when Hibiki was fighting up back against Pidgey. It's 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 a tough tough on this. I mean, they've been going at it since. Oh wow! Since like he got the, yeah he got the he got the soft call there on the down air, and he came up to get it. And that hitbox is just horrible. I love it. <laughs> That's game two. Yeah, That's game now. two. So this is now I got the score. turning point. This could Jack, be it. Can Jack win this game in two minutes and make his turn? Probably not the slightest, not. but... <laughs> <laughs> there he is with the 73. He's going for the Yoshi. Bring in the Yoshi. 73 tag. Even if he loses, I'm pro. Yeah, let's see if you can bring this one. <laughs> now, Smashville, relatively neutral stage for both of them, I would say. Uh, yeah, I mean, Toon Link bad stage wise, it's only, like, to be, for me, like, it's really only like that. Yeah. Um, and if anything else, I mean,. I, I ban Lila a lot against players. I know. You um, ban Lila against me, and I just thought myself, like, 
have. Yeah. I was going to go for that. Yeah, but no, I that's mean, fair <laughs> Against certain players, I won't ban it just because I know they're not going to take me there because they hate it just as much. Yep. But um, I mean, apart from that, it's all right. My it's a great stage for you. Yeah. I, I mean, I used to ban Town and City a lot just because. Toon Link isn't the heaviest, but he's he's not the lightest either, but um, just those low ceilings I yeah, find yeah. were causing me trouble. Um, I've kind of gotten over that now, and I'm happy to try and use that for an advantage to myself. Say, like, when, it, when it gets to the flat uh, transition, yeah. you've got to take full advantage of that, yeah. Yeah, um, but the, uh, and certainly Lilac, those jank edges are just horrible, and the fact that half the platform is covered by reasonably low platforms, yeah. it just ruins if you're trying to like use bombs to, to okay. actually... Uh, recover there um, or, or bombs to cover your landings yeah it just ruins that another thing I've noticed is um, Toon Link's recovery is quite linear would you say it's very linear but um, can I mean, you mix it up or I mean the, the best mix up you can do with Toon Link's recovery is bombs. when you're recovering you just use a bomb to cover yourself yeah. and if you do that there's not a lot people can really do about it unless yeah, they yeah. jump really far over yeah, yeah, to try yeah, and get they go too deep yeah but yeah I mean but if they do that instead of recovering towards the stage you just recover away from it and you I mean and you still make it back because you're recovering yeah, high I must admit like Toon Link's Toon Link's recovery is is his upbeat it has excellent priority mm. excellent yeah, yeah. priority I mean It'll even, like, I mean, for example, like another good guy, so Mario's upbeat, his, yeah. the recovery on his upbeat is really good. But the, uh, but Toon Link will out prioritize it. That's insane. Yeah. I mean, Toon Link is by, I mean, again, he's always going to have the question of frame data, which is his biggest flaw. Yes. Um, that always left me puzzled it because I always see Toon Link being placed mid, and I think myself, like, because, because, well, Aberdeen, yeah. well, Scotland, really. Scotland, I mean, Scotland has. You know, Toon Link fetish, pretty much. Well, yeah, I mean, there's there's me and there's Jack, and, you know, Toon Link is damn good. And, I mean, you even see it in, like, the <clears throat> the likes of uh, uh, Ireland with uh, Nate. Yeah. Um, I mean, he's a Rosamine, but he's secondary as Toon Link for the purpose of being able to beat EOE, you yeah. know, so. Yeah. Um, because the Rosa Peach matchup is cheap now, but I don't know enough about it, to be honest, but I'm guessing it must be yeah, pretty if bad. He, if, if he has he a single like Toon Link up. If he has a secondary for Rosa, <laughs> yeah. it, it means something. Oh, wow, that was an excellent, excellent combo. Ooh, there we go. Yeah. Pidgey gonna have a tough time pulling this match in. Oh, right, I'm, I'm not. I'm not thinking about looking at a three stock. Yeah. I mean, I think a three stock is unlikely, but Pidgey does have some excellent comeback games. So. Oh, definitely. Um, same to Jack. So I mean, if unless Jack gets tether glitched or uh, done in by a, a forward error, I mean, he could. Could uh, I mean, it could reset the reset this to one one, but. Well, I, I mean, he's got training cards, so... <laughs> yeah. Well, I think it's safe to say that's after uh, half pass. I think he's missed the train now, so... Good chizzy, and yourself? Yeah. Oh, Lewis had your tag or something? Yeah, Lewis has a tag. He's got a ring shirt. Chronicles? Lewis Chizzy Chronicles. Awesome. <laughs> Lewis represent. Oh, oh, wink, wink. Yeah. You have to. No, no, no. Yeah. Oh, right. yeah, I'm just gonna Well done. How much are we? 75 for the winner. Yeah. Oh, 76 for the winner. And uh, I think it's about 34 ish for a second. And, uh, third place gets a toy. Yeah, third, third place gets a toy. <laughs> I can't believe you know, I'm done with the <laughs> Sorry, Dougie. Next time, next time. I did get tether glitched though. Hey? <laughs> I got tether glitched though. I don't know what I. It's horrible. <laughs> yeah, this is uh, the, this. Well, if Jack wins this, this is the last match. Oh, is the bracket reset? Yeah, just getting that. Uh, no, the, the bracket's not been reset. So this this is Jack coming through winners. Uh, well, wait, the way things are looking could be over soon. I mean, Jack just making absolute dominance here with the, the projectiles. Oh, I mean, the arrows, the boomerangs, everything. There we go. Yeah, That's yes. it. And finally, trying to attack Jakobin, taking reset tournament. 30, boys. So, final destination two sees Jakobin is defending his title at uh, our little tournament here. We, we need to step uh, up our game. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> Hib Hibiki finishing well again.